Whoa! Carbon Knights Gaming? Hello Knights and welcome back! I just had to show you this awesome statue that says he made. It's... <laughs> I don't know where she came up with the idea. Obviously I'm guessing it's Lion King inspired, but man, I love it. We're over here today in the shopping district though, or well at spawn, technically. But uh, there's a new rocket shop. We got some people over there. Hi, Spooks. He pickled me. Yeah, show you. I'll pickle you right back, buddy. Yeah, that's what you get. <laughs> anyway, we're over here. Uh, we're gonna make our uh, our new shop right after the pickles are done. The first thing we gotta do is I think make this one bigger on each. Well, we won't go one bigger on that side. We'll go two bigger this way. And that way we can have a nine round shop. You'll see why it has to be uh, round in a minute. You might have already guessed what it's going to be, but... Uh, oh, we also have to go back to, right. Uh, so here it should be. Okay, whoa, that was, there's a bunch of people on, so sometimes there's a little bit of lag, but I wasn't expecting that much. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow, this is really close to the other path. It should be okay. Pop that there. And this one wasn't even lined up anyway. So now this should be good, because we're not going to go past any of those blocks. But what we are going to do, we got to take this out. Uh, I don't have enough blocks on me, so let's drop off our shulkers. Let's put them over here. This just has our potions and stuff in it. And the yellow one, we'll put a little closer, because that's where I put all the ingredients for... Ingredients? All the materials for making our shop. <laughs> ingredients okay uh and i guess we'll put this one down too why not put it down right there just so you can't open that white one yep that's exactly what happened but now we got to move this so let's do that make sure we put it back somewhere too so that it looks nice because i don't know if these came with the village or if they were built here by someone else but either way i like the way they look so we're gonna keep them uh, maybe we'll put it, you know what, let's put it over here, on this side. This one didn't have one. So we'll actually, oh, I keep hearing the fire, you know what, let's put it right here. Hopefully this isn't going to be somebody's place, but I guess I'll just throw that water out there. If this is going to be someone's shop at some point, they can move it. I'm sure they won't mind. And then we'll put in our flowers that we had. And there we go. Now we still beautified the city while we made our industrial project. Although it's not really industrial. <laughs> in fact, you'll see what it is in the time lapse coming up right now.
Okay, now that the bottle's built, I hope it looks good. Uh, it was spooky and Morgan approved, so I assume it does look good. That, well, messed that up immediately. <laughs> Let's, uh, there we go. Actually, no, maybe it would look better if it was at the back there. Let me just, that is not even close. Messing all kinds of stuff up right now. I'm too excited to get my shop started. There we go. Let's put them like this. That'll look better. We'll put them all in over here. And I think maybe we'll put the signs above. I was going to put the signs on them. But how's that going to look? Mm, not too bad, but you know what? Oh, now I have a... Well, let's see what it looks like above. Okay, let's see what it looks like above. Oh yeah, above above won't be too bad. I wonder if it'll look bad from the outside. Um, uh, nah. Well, yeah, okay, maybe I'll just put them on the front. I think that's probably the better way to go. But let's see what we got over here. We have uh, poison. And we have, oh, that's what we'll do. We'll put the splash potions on one side, maybe. Although I think we only have a couple of splash ones. The rest are all, yeah, maybe we won't do that. I'll just put it on the sign. But anyway, so we had poison. What was it? Invisibility, a poison weakness, water breathing, invisibility. Let's see what else we got. So let's start. Front and center here. Poison. Uh, I'll do splash. No. Poison splash? Yeah, that'll work. One. Diamond. Four. Three. Potions. Wow. One day I'll learn how to spell. So that's what I'm going to do for all of them. Well, uh, I, all the ones I have right now are going to be one for three, but I'm going to brew up some, like, probably regeneration at first. Maybe if I can get some leaping, I'll put those on too. I also have to do some swiftness potions, which I haven't done yet, um, but they'll just be one for three as well. But the basically all the potions will be one for three unless it says any different but i really don't i really don't want to just say that in case i change my mind i don't know i think it's going to be one diamond for three potions we'll see how they sell and anything like because regeneration takes like gas tears and shit like that so those will be higher priced so i think because i'm gonna have different potions at different prices i will put the to, to avoid any confusion i'll just put the price on each one Okay, so that's done now. We have two instant health, um, two potions. So I'll put them in, or two shulkers full. So we'll put them there. Uh, other than that, we got invisibility, poison. I think it's poison two even. Uh, weakness, water breathing, and fire resistance. Just for now, we'll have more. I'll put swift, I'll do swiftness like right after I get back to the base. So I'll probably have it in. Uh, and anything else I can do that's, that I have, I'll probably do a regeneration and sell that maybe a diamond, a potion just because gas tears are stupid hard to get, but we also need to put in a payment center here and thank you to spooky who doesn't know. I stole five more iron from him, but he pretty much gave everyone carte blanche on iron for his iron maker thing. So, uh, for his iron farm, I mean, so let me get this down here like so. That's going to bug me. You know what? I need some more spruce. If I can see dirt, even when I'm just going to get the payment, it's going to bug me. So, Or if I can see dirt, I mean. So let me get these all out. And then I will fill them back in with spruce so you'll never know there's ever any dirt there. There we go. And give me one of these. And one of these. And then we'll put a 
I'll sign here. Pay here. Thanks. There we go. This shop is ready to be stocked. We just got to do one more thing. Welcome to Poseidon's Potent Potions. You know what? I think I'm going to take the welcome to off. Oh. You know what, Scrub? I'll just fix the whole sign like this. Easy peasy. No, I don't. It's just Poseidon. It's potent potion potpourri. No, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> uh, how do I get back? Right, you got to do it this way. There we go. Poseidon's potent potions. At the corner of first and third. I don't know. There we go. Now I'm just going to stock. And then we're ready to kick back. Ooh, what that reminds me. I checked earlier. Somebody bought some stuff. So let's see how much we made here. Make sure no one's looking for our secret. You know, we want to make sure that. Uh... Oh, I need an ender chest over there in that shop too. Um, but anyway, our secret combination here. I can't let anybody know what it is. I don't think anyone. Somebody paid. Oh. <laughs> Oh, 35 diamonds, though. Hell yeah. Somebody must have paid dirt for some. <laughs> I mean, that's about what they're worth for those uh, drowned heads. I put pay what you want on there, so I think it's funny that somebody paid dirt for one. Or however many. Maybe a half a stack even? I don't even know, but still funny. But yeah, 35 diamonds. That's not too bad. That's three tridents we sold, because one was a riptide that we sold, and they're 15. But yeah, I'm going to open this up, and then I think I'm going to end it with a little commercial for this shop, because I think that'll that'll be worth it. Also, let me know in the comments, do you think we need a door? I'm not so sure we do, but I'll definitely put an ender chest. In fact, I'll do that right now. I'll just put it right here, on the other side of the door. Then I'll have to make another one for myself when I get home, but... Oh, that's the other thing! I mean, we need a light source in here, so let's... I forgot about that. I even went and went back to the base and made glowstone specifically for this. And then I forgot completely about it. So let's just get these out of here. And we'll just put glowstone right down there in the floor. Just like so. And of course we'll put our red glass back over top. Okay. Now the shop's ready to be stocked. Now that you can actually see in here, I was gonna get. I was gonna go look for. Uh, gonna go look for a way to do that or to show you that, but uh, we got our own B dubs on here, I guess. <laughs> Not that uh, actually. Well, I got my ender chest here. Might as well. Oh, eh, hello. I know you don't do any damage to anything, but. Still don't want to be close to you. You stink, you bastard. Hey, fuck you. Man, rough neighborhood. Anyway, I forgot what I was doing. Diamond block. Hell yeah. Now I'll put this in the ender chest. Oh, I can make another diamond block. Look at that. We have 30 diamond blocks now. And we haven't even opened our second store yet. We're getting rich. Too bad it's almost the end of the season. Just because uh, we're, we're done with Vulgarcraft Season 1 when the uh, the Nether update comes out. So, that will uh, that shouldn't be too long away now. I don't know if I'll ever finish my base, but hey, at least I got this shop open. <laughs> oh, it looks like Spooky's ready. <laughs> almost Spooky. Almost. I just got one more to stock, and that's the weakness potion. Ha! 
Hello, Spooky. Welcome. Shops open. We got our first customer immediately. Holy cow, too? Nice. Well, I'll just let them shop. Hello, potential customer. Are you looking to do all kinds of things that you normally can't do with products found in the market around here? Well, do I have some good news for you then? Poseidon's Potent Potion Emporium is everything you need to go for a swim in a very, very hot tub. Ooh, I can feel the bubbles. Run like an Olympian. Wow, so fast. Run like a faster Olympian. Oh, wow, so much faster. Or wallop your pesky friends in the back of the head without any repercussions. And so, so much more. Rumor has it that we even have one that'll make you into that Wolverine fella from them funny pages. So don't dawdle. Come on down today. You never know when you're going to get a potion that just might save your life. And don't forget to return your bottles. Hey, thanks for sticking around till the end. We appreciate you watching every one of our videos, and if you want to get a hold of us outside of YouTube, all of our social media links are in the description below. If you want to become a knight, why don't you go ahead and click on that subscribe button. And as always, keep those shields up.